Another do and a don't within the Kabbalah Sarada system of Iskrima is based upon some of the fundamental aspects that are used against the number one strike with the pass movement. We're going to investigate a little bit further how effective that pass can be and not be based upon head movement as well as foot movement. Stay with me while we demonstrate. For instance, a number one strike comes in straight over the head or in Sarada Iskrima, it's to the left collarbone. We're taught to let the weapon come directly on the point. So here's a dump as far as the pass movement. Bring in number one, please. Going too far out with the hand can put you in a position of a left hand trap when you're a sailor. You see, if I try to come in, I can switch it up and dip the head, but it's a little too fast for me to have to react. The bad part about this particular type of block, again, number one, is to keep the hand, again, too far. It allows your opponent to be able to do too many things. The proper way of doing the pass empty-handed is to allow the weapon to come in and dip the head underneath the assailant's weapon rather than try to stay straight up and down on the line. So you want to be able to actually let the tactic come in or the strike, even if I didn't use the trap hand, because of my movement of the head, I'm still in a position of safety. From there, I can work my safety and do what I want. So, that is a do and a don't off of a number one strike and a pass movement. Thank you.